Welcome to the next episode of Let's Play Breath of the Wild with the Zelda Lady featuring that guy and the Duke. And hey, Duke's on the controls today. We're going to head into the castle. Here we go. Welcome to Season 3. Okay. Are we in? Go into Hyrule Castle in the weird 3D map. Super easy to walk through. <laughs> and as you can see, huh. we're, the yellow yeah, diamond is us, and we're at the very bottom of the 3D map, um, heading into one of the entrances. The it's, of course, it's raining. The rook. And uh, the here rook. we go. My top. Anything to pick up in those? Gosh, nothing. Oh, well. Oh. Hey, how's the lady? Yeah, what's Where that? Where do those bats come from? They just the spawn ball. the key. They're just Are they in certain annoying. areas, or when do they? Well, you know, they're also homage to the original NES. The keys from the very first um, Legend of Zelda, the original NES game. Homage. Ooh. Homage, yeah. You know. Homage. Is that French? <laughs> Man, that was light speed, not even 30 seconds. Yeah, is that, is that <laughs> Habitual line stepper. Mm -hmm. um, yeah. Homage. <laughs> homage. I Can I probably homage your decoupage? If you do a homage to decoupage, would it be like <laughs> 60 style? Yeah, of course. You could do a mod homage to decoupage. Okay. okay. <laughs> collage. <laughs> it could be a collage. Oh yeah, decoupage <laughs> is often a collage. Exactly. So your mod homage collage out of decoupage yeah. could be an actual thing. It is an actual thing. I got one. You want to it? <laughs> uh, you know, I have one too. I store hey, yeah, it. I store it in a box. Stuff. I oh, store it in a box. Store so that. Store that. That homage collage out of decoupage. I store it in a box. Guess what else is in that box? And I'll bet you have one too. And it's an owl. And that owl is brown. And that brown is made of macrame. Oh, that owl. Do you have one of those? I don't give a hoot about it. <laughs> <laughs> let's, let's talk about you, we made them at the same time. That's what I mean. Oh. Yeah, that brings me back to like early 1970s. Mm. That's why I thought of the brown. The owl is a different homage. Uh, yeah, but it's the same era. Early 70s um, home decor. Yeah, uh, There, there was a, a lot of brown and avocado going of, on. I think a voice of leather. Uh, Cases that haven't been dusted. Um, no, that's lawyer cases mm. with glass. Not what I think of Very like Northwest the Seattle, you know. I don't Oregon. think of. I don't think of those when I think of Oregon. Sorry. I think of dusty book mold. Gross. Um, big libraries. Uh, a lot of books. Yeah, books that do tend to smell like mildew. Mm -hmm. It's kind of unavoidable. Uh, it's a for me probably. It's I wonder what the experience. Library of Congress smells like. I wish I knew. We were oh, so it smells well. Those we were standing on the outside of it. It was a sad day for Zelda Lady and that guy. We went right up to it, to the Library of Congress, and it was close. Ah, it was so sad. That is so sad. <laughs> it is. So I turned around. And went, Let's go get hot dogs. <laughs> <laughs> We did something touristy. We were in Washington, D.C. We, for the first we time. We were on wheels. You know I mean? <laughs> we had a lot of fun. <laughs> we were more like the banana split. You know? <laughs> they we... were chasing each other around all the time. But we got all right. Around. So we're digging, in, digging into the castle here. And uh, the next time I go to Washington, D.C., it's fish all the way, baby. Yeah, they had a um, really I mean, cool marina. Tacos, country. fish. Fish, fish, fish. Yeah, fish. I would be really happy to explore that with you as well because Washington, D.C. has an awesome arena district and an up and coming, like, trendy area. Um, and a cool fish market, outdoor fish market. Yeah, boy. Damn. It's, uh, it's every bit of Pike Street, Seattle. Looks nice. Oh, yeah. It's, it, it's, it's definitely just, it's a port, and you can tell that, you know, there's, like, there's marina, there's port, there's boats. You know, the Lord. It's, 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 no, it's not. It's East Coast and West Coast. But, I'm just saying, it's because of the size of the market. I mean, Tyson has all kinds of vendors. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Strip away all that and just say the fish part. Yeah. 
Uh, I think they have a bigger fishing industry in Puget Sound than they do in that little port at Washington, D.C. Um, but I hear what you're saying. There's lots of vendors. I'm just talking a, about yeah, the market and yeah. like being a consumer and looking at the amount of Cascar. Ooh, that's a good beer. That's Spanish for fish. Cascar. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay. They had a lot of Pascar, a lot of different varieties, you know? Is that the cross here? And uh, while I was there, a friend of mine, his wife made a crab cake. And uh, I don't know if it was the excitement of seeing an old friend and uh, or, and, or if, you know? No, those were bomb crab cakes. <laughs> those were, okay, they were the bomb. They were really, really good. And uh, I thought, yeah, you, you know, go all the way up to make the stairs. It's just like a crab <gasps> oh, sandwich and nutrition is more. You can't beat that in San Francisco. No, you can't. But you can't beat the crab cakes in Maryland. <laughs> I'm, just, I'm sorry. I agree. Uh, hey, where are you going, dude? Oh, what happens when you do that? Oh, it starts the wind gust? Uh huh. And you can go further up. Yeah. Nice. I did not know that. Um, I'm not entirely sure. Um, we need to go into the, um, lockup and get the Hylian shield. That's what we really need to do. Okay. That is where you're at, or just at the lower level. Just below it. Oh, you can probably just go down. Yeah, you can just go down. Whoa, I think you just go to the out <laughs> on the outside to get into it, though. I don't think you can access it from the inside. I, I may be wrong. These maps are so hard to remember. Oh, here we are. We're in lockup. How'd you get in there? That was so fast. We followed the path. We followed the path. <laughs> <laughs> All right, smarty pants. Now, how do you get in it from there? Um, <laughs> is it negligible? Yeah, yeah. Oh, can you shoot the eyeball? Yeah. And when you shoot the eyeball, does that help you do anything? Oh, it does. Yeah. Wow. It opens the door. How convenient. And you know where to go, right? Uh, You're going to find that one um, cell where the um, giant is, the skeleton. Salmox, I guess it's called? The Hinox skeleton eyeball thing. Okay. You don't have to fight all these guys. I know, I know. Oh, Jesus. That's a homage to a 1980s uh, band. Early 1980s. <laughs> What? what? Wham, wham. Oh. <laughs> Can you name the members of that band? <laughs> no. Can you? Yeah. Ooh, I don't know cool. George Michael for sure. I can't remember the other guy's name. Andy. Oh yeah, Andy something. Andy, wait. Andy, no. Andy, oh. yeah, okay, good. I'm glad I wasn't the only one who couldn't remember something from 30 years ago. <laughs> or 40 years Is ago. Is that what you're talking about, man? <laughs> Wham was a hell of a uh, phenomenon. I need to talk about Wham. I like Wham.
Okay. So we need to find that one cell. I'll probably cut out. Yeah. Sorry. Uh, what cell are we looking for? We're looking for the Hinox. Okay. The Oops, buggy will be there. skeleton one. Okay, cool. There we go. You stop it. Ah ha ha ha. Yeah, he's definitely there. Keep going. Maybe go around the corner. Bomb of wall. Is there a bomb of a wall? Uh oh. There he is. Totally. Okay. We're into the fight for a treasure that we definitely want. It's a good idea. Get a good weapon to beat the snot out of that eyeball when it falls down. There's a couple of good, uh, Claymore, is it like a 72 Claymore? He's trying to hide his eyeball! He's got weapons jamming oh. to his hip. Oh my goodness, thank you! I'm gonna do that again, that's a one shot. Yeah. 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 And so, oh. Still yeah. Gotta, yeah, you still got it. Yeah, I think you got to free hit it. choice gets tough right now. Um, mm. The only thing I would maybe switch was for that Thunderblade, because, you know, being able to shock the enemies yeah, is nice, yeah. but ooh, that yeah. Hylian Shield! We now have it. Excellent. Oh, Good work. Sorry, I'm going to leave you behind. Yeah, I'm going to leave you behind. Mm. Yep. lift that gate for the knife. I think that I meant him magnesis or something. Oh. I forgot I had it on the time thing. There's a way to cancel it, too. Oh, that is that. Is that how you got in there? Oh, one of the ways. Uh oh, oh. Alright, 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 alright. 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 <laughs> huh. Yeah. Mm. Is in the very back. You're actually not far from mm. it. Actually, if you go in that bottom one across, or to the right, or is it the left one? I. It's one of the two. It, I think it's the one you're right next to. Actually, if you come around the rock. Uh huh. I think this is actually. Actually, you're here. This is it. Oh, sweet. <laughs> job. That was super easy. There's a a great uh, flame blade in the just stuck in the ground if you yeah. these stairs. Or on the way out, the different ways. Or it might be the top of these stairs. But for sure the shrine's at the top of it. And you know how to do it, right? Yeah. The roof's protection is now ready to oh. Look at that, that was awesome! A keys frozen keys. <laughs> <laughs> not in the ice variety. <laughs> I hate those. Did you ever have a Swiss Army knife? I did, of course. Okay. Cool. Did it empower you? I did, and you know, I thought if I ever had a use for this corkscrew, I'll really know how to use it because it was really it intrigued me. <laughs> <'Cause> right. <laughs> and I was like, how would I know exactly yeah. how I would use it? But yeah. I never had a use to use it because, right. of course, uh, you know, I, I had it when I was a campfire girl. Yeah. So I'm talking like 10 year old. The 10 year old doesn't have a lot of opportunity to open wine bottles. <laughs> 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 or shouldn't. No. So 
So, but it was a curiosity well, to me. If you're a gamer, that was so cool. Never that, and it's a big, it's a big piece of the Swiss Army knife. Is a big old sword. I, I, I particularly <laughs> enjoy the scissors on the bigger knife. I didn't have scissors on mine. I know what you're talking knife, about. Yeah. yeah, I did have a toothpick. That was just so, um, so it was so prestigious. That's kind had... of where I got that. Uh, you know that uh, something that's supposed to be made small. You know. Yeah, mine no. had a corkscrew and had a, a nail file. Right. It, it had uh, like three knives. Uh, one with a serrated blade. Right. Um, did you ever use that one? Yes, I did. Actually, I used the camping like you should because I used it for the proper tool that it was for. Yeah. We used it starting it fire. Comes in handy. Yeah. You know, like, I mean, we. Like pretend, not pretend. We actually made a fire, but it was like a lesson setting where all of us girls learned how to specifically Make start a fire, a fire with a Which starting knife. Which is handy. Yeah. In the <laughs> yeah. exactly. I'll take the so, girl who knows you know, how to start a fire. <laughs> with any a day. Knife. <laughs> Over Becky, I'm sorry, Over Becky. <laughs> Didn't you bring the Twinkies? Uh, <laughs> you were supposed to bring hamburgers. Uh, <laughs> I'm hungry. Uh, <laughs> if we're going home. <laughs> My thing is, I always bring too much. I spend the whole day packing it in and the rest of the day packing it out. Huh. Um, so there is a, a ice palace hiding in this section. Oh. I can't remember exactly where he's at. Why is he ice? Um, I don't remember why he's ice either, but I know there's, there's a ice section, baby. and it's in this region. I think you have to go outside and around. Mm -hmm. But there's a um, there's a Korok seed that's hiding, and you have to have a, a hard boiled egg. Oh, I the, passed that one already. for the shrine. But I don't have any hard. Oh, there's down. Anyway, you know what I'm talking no, about. No, I know there. they're down. And down there. in that is same underneath area is a stone Titus. Do you want to do? Or we could move on and um, head over and start the camping valley. Um, it's it's in a funky little place. Send it around the other side so the castle's at the back, and then tip the bottom. Oh, the castle. And then that thing. Yeah. Where? Well, now you have it. What I'm calling the front. So flip it around. Why is this the front? This is the back. That is the back. So I want to see the front. There you go. Now flip it. <laughs> now flip it so you can see like the. A, a eagle eye image. I did? Yeah. Okay. Oh. So where that is, is you see how the the road loops around and goes up and then uh -huh. back around? When it's going up and around, see uh -huh. there's a little building there. It's underneath there. Not in the circular uh -huh. building, but see, see what I'm talking about? It's like a little weird L-shaped wall. The road yeah. goes, the road goes yeah. up. Yeah, yeah, and yeah, the yeah, top yeah. of that loop, there's yeah. a little, it has a square part of the roof of it. Yeah. That underneath there is where that is. Yeah. Okay. It took me 17 years to find it one time. That's why I specifically know on that little weird map where how to find it. <laughs> okay. We might as well go get it. We might as well go I'm get going it. right now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm exactly right. I mean, I know. I believe you. <laughs> no doubt about that. Oh yeah. Aren't those some cool? Oh yeah. I also got the um the last the last amiibo minute I did. Go back. Oh, yeah. I, I did it off camera, but look what I, we got. What? The chic mask. It's by the self. Oh. No. Run over. Go up. Two up. Oh! <gasps> <laughs> Thank you. You're welcome. That's awesome. <laughs> Isn't that cool? <laughs> That's very cool. That's I got that yesterday morning. I was like, ah, I forgot about it. Thank you, Amiibos. That's awesome. Best invention ever. That makes the game brand new. Yeah, what happened to the Meepo moment, man? Hey, I really dug that. You know, you went to the store, man. You, we're on Meepo <laughs> minute number four or five. <laughs> five, five posted a Meepo minute. Is that all? Is that all? <laughs> Let's get back to Meepo minute. Okay, I, we, I, yeah, I did one for one. Ooh. I did it for this file today. Okay. We can do it for the other file we're working on. Okay. Uh, can I that you can though? sum up if you put change your shirt. Oh, I know. I just have to ask that first before I say something stupid and waste my time. No, you definitely can sum up uh, most of the waterfalls. Ooh, that was a weird angle. But they have the huge current, most of them do. So. 
almost paid to put on the whole suit. Yeah, well, we have the um, salvager. <laughs> oh, we do? Yeah, part of it, I think. But yeah, the headgear. See the headgear. We also have the Rudania um, helm. See the Rudania helm? I'm sure that helps too in some up. Yeah. Oh. yeah that's cool, huh? I, mean, I would yeah, go for the like helm. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, look at that cool helm. Oh, I can't see his head. Look at the back of it. That's awesome. Oh my gosh. How much do you love that? <laughs> okay. Um, where are we going? Where are we? Oh, yeah, we're going into the. Okay, we're not going right little funky there. Yeah. Okay, oh, you don't have to right now. Mama. Yep, with that little ability out of the four. I mean, they all four have awesome elements, but that Gale, oh, it, that Gale, man. <laughs> you have the Royal Guard Greaves on, too? Yeah, we don't have we do. Oh yeah. Just sort it, Neil. Soon. Oh. The trousers of the wild or the wind. I really like. Oh, those. you. Oh, cool. Yeah. Oh, the yeah. boots. They call them boots. Yep. The white boots. White gloves. The white boots. Reminds me of uh, <laughs> another hobby I did in my youth. I was in a drum and bugle corps. And we had white boots and white gloves <laughs> and had to polish the white boots uh -huh. in March. Uh, uh -huh. Color guard. Yep. <laughs> is now ready. Oh, Gail's ready. Wow, that was interesting. How did that tip over? You said it was here? Um, no. No. You said it was in the... No. It's above there. Oh. See? <laughs> Top of that road. <laughs> Look again. See? See the guard chamber? That's the circular building where the Lionel's at? Yeah. See the road? If you're there and you're going through that bit, the road goes through that guard uh -huh, shack. Uh -huh. If you're coming out of it on your way to the castle, uh -huh. when the road loops to the top, uh -huh. you see that little building at the top of the loop of the top of the road. Uh -huh. It has a square roof, like the yeah. one you're at, yeah, but yeah. it's the one above it. And it, oh, it's okay. underneath there. So it's funky through there. So you're going to want to gale up and get a good look at what you're looking at. So. Yeah. You got all I got you. Yeah, they, they have identical squares, so I can see how that could happen. Oh, God. Okay. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> this castle map is, um, more, more difficult than the, the main map, I think, topography-wise. Oh, yeah. mm -hmm. The 3D, 3D imaging of it, um, yeah, you're like facing. Uh, yeah. Nope, nope, don't go up. You want to go around? Uh, oh, this way? Yes. See, now put on the map where you're at. See, yes. Um, uh, it's, down, it's down in there. Is there an entrance? <laughs> it's like a little cave. Oh, oh Lizzie. Double Lindsay. <laughs> Double Lindsay. Yeah, that means a sideways hop. Lindsay hop. <laughs> he calls it the Lindsay hop. <laughs> that is the Lindsay hop. <laughs> that's an old thing. <laughs> yeah, that's where they got. Okay, it, it's totally there. I don't know where the entrance is. He has a shrine shape, but he's just a guardian. Yeah. He's a guardian doctor above. That is one of the funnest parts when you're going up Death Mountain and opening up uh, the Lizard. Oh, Divine oh. Bee. Oh, whoa, I think you just found it. Gate Passage, nice. Yes, that is exactly it. You have to fight off all these keys. You have to knock them out before you try to get in there. Nice, suckers. 
I will take your eyeball. Eyeballs are worth fifteen, fifteen dollars, or eighteen rupees, something. Like that. I remember I needed some money, and I was like, I was looking for some long parts to sell, and I was like, this is surprisingly worth a pretty good little penny. Since they're so common, uh -huh. you know, the key swings are only worth like two dollars or two rupees. Always grab an eyeball. <laughs> the moral of the story is. And he's in ice. Yeah. For some reason, I. You're right. It's a good question. Why is it an ice one? Maybe because he's under the ground. But they're all in the ground. The food's new, but you're gonna need your fire arrows for sure. Cool him off immediately. <clears throat> Right? But that doesn't help me from not I don't being frozen. think so. No, it's not gonna help you. Oh, you can be unfreezable with Zan helmet. Yep, yep, yep. Put it. Oh, he's just saving the sound tower. What the heck? I don't know. It is my pleasure. I looked it up. My recollection was that he was a. Oh, but he's being like right there. Yeah. Um, you know, use a uh, robust theory to attack him. My bow break. Whoa, right in my face. You bomb yourself in the face. <laughs> We need little baby palaces to come out. <laughs> nice. Pommel time. Oh, we got one good shot out. Ooh! Oh, shield. Ooh! The shield is up. <laughs> he fell out real quick again. Um, I would recommend bombing some bombing some arms off. Oh, I've been trying to do that. Oh, good. Oh, I don't know why. I think because the environment you're in is like all walls. Okay. Come on, he got him. Nice job. Yeah, yeah. That's gonna increase the arsenal. Whoa. Oh, he unlocked the passageway. <gasps> Two of chests. I'm so blown away oh, right now. Oh, <laughs> I never did that. <gasps> what? Cool. That's the best chest ever. How cool is that? It was a thing? Mm hmm. You're kidding me. Not and a all. diamond? Nice. Okay, so I need a I need a I need a mulligan on the don't spend any diamonds run through that we're doing. Uh -huh. yeah, here it comes. Here it comes. And, I, the, and the, the problem is I the lost the, the I lost the great elbow, and the only way to replace it, as we all know, uh -huh. is to use a swallow bowl, some rupees, and a diamond. And so, I was gonna ask for the mulligan of, you know, in uh, Zora's Domain, there's that one guy that will trade you ten luminous stones for a diamond. Yeah. And so, that's the mulligan. If we need to replace a weapon uh -huh. with a diamond, uh -huh. the only way to do that is to go get a diamond by trading in ten luminous stones. Gotcha. Is that fair? Yeah. Awesome. That guy, what do you think? <laughs> Yeah. Okay, That's cool. Good <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> Use what you got to get what you want. Right. Okay. okay. And that's the only thing we'd ever need a diamond for. And by the way, we have like 24 diamonds at this point. Okay. Which is 12,000 oh. rupees. Okay. That's the, that's the street value of those diamonds is 12,000 rupees. That's pretty cool. 12,000 Yeah, 12,000 rupees. 
But we are gonna need a good pen to open the last fairy. He's expensive. Okay, you're right in that same area where that um, Korok seed is. Yeah. Please. I don't know, it might. No, it's an offering. No, this is it. No, this definitely isn't an offering, but. I think he's gone down to the timeline. Oh, it is one. Oh, but I'm oh, telling that's you, my there's, a, there's an offering around there somewhere, too. He's my favorite. That guy with the helicopter. Uh huh. He's got a great attitude. Nice. Yeah. Yeah. All right. So we figured out our problem with uh, regenerating weapons. And um, <laughs> thanks, guys. And uh, You're welcome. Pretty much handled a lot of the castle for now. We're gonna go get a little stronger though out in Hyrule before we try to take on Ganon. So we'll see you on the next episode of Let's Play Breath of the Wild with the Zelda Lady on the next episode where you will see us in Hyrule. See you then. Thanks guys. <laughs>